one of the few private entries was Porfirio Ruberosa. Better known as a man about the world than a driver, Ruberosa has achieved small success. His driving is nervous and unsteady. He seems more drawn to sandbanks and oil drums than to the finish line. But he is on occasion very fast, which indicates that with more experience he might well become a threat to factory teams. Uh, Mr. Ruberosa, could you tell us a little something about the car that you're driving today? Well, I'm driving a two-liter Ferrari, and I think the car is in good shape. We had a little accident uh, day before yesterday. The pilot hit the uh, gasoline drum, but we repair it, and it's, everything is all right. Good. Uh, this is the only two-liter Ferrari here, isn't it? No, no, no. There's another one. There's another two-liter Ferrari, and uh, there's about nine cars in the E category. What, what do you think of the course? Well, I think the course is a uh, very good condition. It's harder than, than last year because they uh, put some gasoline uh, drums in the curve over there and it makes, uh, makes it uh, harder, more difficult. What car were you driving last year? A two-liter Ferrari, too. Well, the same car? Not the same, but uh, the same category. Uh, who are you driving with today? With Gene Pauly, an American boy. I see. And you're splitting the driving time evenly? Evenly. Three hours each. Uh, I start and uh, he follows the next three hours, the next three me, and he, he finished. Do you expect to use a, lo a lot of tires today? Well, uh, no. Uh, maybe we can finish the whole thing with one set of tires. 